All right, everybody, welcome back. Uh, let's go ahead and give you a rundown of what we did since you missed us last. See, we got the tank. We got the pipe cut out of it and uh, took a big section out, dropped it down in there. We got about a four inch gap between here and the tank now. Um, we've got a tack welded in four spots around here. I don't know if you can see those. But what, what I'm trying to accomplish is uh, trying to keep it level. I want this as flat as possible with the middle of the tank. That way whenever uh, we start barbecuing, you, you don't want the tank sitting crooked. So the best way I find to level it is this opening right here. I don't know if you can see what it says on there, but uh, it actually says Buckeye. Convenient, I know. I'm a Buckeye. Uh, so we got it level. That's pretty level. I don't think we'll get it much closer than that. And we went ahead and leveled this up with some angle iron on it. So that's pretty close. Uh, we got it just fit, it's sitting on top of some 2x4s right now. Or some 2x8s, uh, 2x10s. Anyway, uh, I just wanted to show you what we did so far. Well, basically, that pipe's been shortened down. I'm going to weld it all the way around now. It's going to be a hairier weld. As you can see, some of the... Some of these gaps from this plasma cutter are, I mean, I, I can damn near put my fingers through there. So that's going to be some tough welding. Um, I might have to bust up a stick welder on it. That's that's a lot. That's a big job for a MIG. It ain't going to be pretty no matter what I do. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to show y'all. Um, I'll touch bases with y'all whenever we get that welded out. All right. Later. Bye.